things like shoelaces and that sort of stuff. You know, you have to have a uh, things, little things like that, which will help you uh, not have to tie the shoelaces, but they they, they hold the shoelaces together. I've lost with this multiple sclerosis business. The sensations in my hands uh, several times, and I've had to learn to do everything from the beginning to the end. So, you know, even rolling over in bed is a problem. So when when they they get me out of bed and I've, I've managed to move over to the canteen after several months of recovery now. I mean, it's not like that at the beginning of the of, of the attacks, but uh, at the age of 51, it's beginning to get a bit slow to recover. So they gave me things like this, bits of bits of tube, which I put my fork in, like that. And it makes it easy to hold. Also, if you put your pen in there, it's easy to write. Because uh, your memory traces are still there, but you have to use a much bigger uh, motor. Uh, I don't know what did you have to do, but you have to do it anyway. Anyway, they gave they give you the knives and forks like this in hospital, um, and you can see them there. They've got big, huge, super handles on them, and those those are quite easy to to manipulate. But eventually, you have to recover all the motor facilities that are necessary to live in civilization, if you can. So this is how you do it. I'll just take this off. Now, one of the big problems with multiple sclerosis is that it faces the memory. Uh, so that something I used to do three times a day since I was seven, 17 years old, I don't remember how to do it anymore. So it take me, took me about three weeks to re relearn how to do this. And now you've got to put your thumb to the loop there. There's a loop at the back. You put your thumb through. There. Put, put that through there, round the back. There it goes. But I forgot completely how to do this. So the guy used to do it all the time. It's quite a good way to set uh, straighten the shirt. It's difficult to do it in the mirror. I haven't done it in the mirror before. I should do it for, without a mirror. There you go. So there you have it, ready for, well this isn't a concert bow tie, but it's, a, uh, it's one you can see I suppose. And things like uh, bank numbers and bank passes and uh, pin codes, impossible to remember. You think you've got a good monomic and, and then something happens and there's bank numbers. and.